so dear student as i am discussing about the list i have shown you uh, videos uh, previous videos i have uploaded that basic of interactive mode and one program i have shown you in the script based mode now <coughs> again i will return back to the interactive mode in this interactive mode what i will do let us do some implementation of the list again okay suppose uh, i am writing here a uh, list list 1 equals to what i need to specify something suppose list so what is a list i am giving it computer okay so i am writing here computer i am closing it now i am calling list 1 is it now if i give that uh, there is an empty list also we can create in a various form okay that means we can also create the empty specification of the list so empty list means where there the data what are there the data that we will going to implement the data that we will going to give those the data see here if i write here suppose b If I write here, suppose B equals to what? Third bracket open, third bracket close. Okay. So if I write this, that means what I am saying, I am specifying a particular thing. Now I'll call what? I'll call B to be what? Print. Print B okay that means it is an empty set this particular empty set that has been there and this particular empty set is what it is been executing okay so this empty set is executing here and we are creating those empty set also so this way also we can create the empty set now i am coming to a little bit of slicing as i have shown you the slicing that particular slicing will be shown to you okay so slicing here uh, we can also see see here another part i have uh, created for you that list two equals to open the bracket close the bracket end oh, sorry the minus sign has been given list two equals to now list open the bracket close the bracket enter now list to empty bracket so this is how you can also create the empty phase okay so empty phase you can create on the list item to implement the list in the various form implement the list in the various part of it okay so this is how you can create the basic structure of the list and you can implement the basic structure of the list that are there <coughs> so this is what is your list next i'll come to this particular section that is called your slicing slicing we have done earlier also uh, slicing i have shown you in the string part also how to slice how to bring it so in the list how you can implement and how you can do that i am going to show you the different type of slicing of the word okay different pattern of slicing of the words that i have written for you here uh, those are some examples uh, that uh, are based on this only i am going to show you so that you can see from here it will be easier for you okay those the thing will be easier for you to implement and to work with that how the slicing is been utilized and how it has been done so i think the uh, list phase or the list work is now little bit clear to you seeing the previous videos and these videos <coughs> how to implement the interactive mode and how to do with the script based mode this is an interactive mode i am doing script based mode one program also i have shown you previously that how to implement in the script based mode and uh, more the program i am going to show you in the coming videos so this is how is our interactive mode so a uh, little bit more